I've come to a warehouse and here they test lots of different machines that we use around the home, like washing machines, cookers and vacuum cleaners. There are lots of different vacuum cleaners here in different shapes and sizes and colours. But how does a vacuum cleaner work? This is the button that you use to switch it on and off. And this part here is the hose that sucks up bits. It's like a snake, isn't it? And then this part just here is the pedal, which you use to roll it along. But there are lots of parts of this vacuum cleaner that you can't see. But here at the warehouse, we've got special permission to take a vacuum cleaner apart so we can look at some of the important parts inside. There are a lot of different parts to a vacuum cleaner, aren't there? Let's look at some of the most important ones. So this here is the motor and it moves this part inside. It's called the fan. Can you see the fan moving? And it's the motor that makes a lot of noise. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> this is the agitator brush and it sits right at the bottom of the vacuum cleaner and its job is to brush along the carpet really quickly. Ooh. This here is the container and it just catches all of the dirt. And this part which sits on top of it is the filter and this bit traps the dust. But to find out how a vacuum cleaner sucks up all of the bits of dirt and dust really quickly, I think we need to take a closer look inside. When the vacuum cleaner is switched on, the motor inside moves a fan which spins really, really fast. It's so fast that it causes the fan to suck air from the outside up through a suction pipe. Just like sucking a straw. The rotating agitator brush on the bottom of the vacuum cleaner loosens the dirt and dust on the carpet. The air, dust and dirt are then sucked up the pipe into the vacuum. The air spins around really fast and the dirt falls to the bottom of the container and is caught in a filter. The air is pushed through the filter and the clean air is blown back outside through the exhaust. When the carpet is vacuumed, the container full of bits and dirt is emptied, ready for next time. That was brilliant, wasn't it? Now, I'm going to use my special camera so we can see how it works close up. But remember, this is a special camera, so you mustn't do this yourself. I'm going to put the special camera inside the container. So we can see exactly what it sucks up. Looks good. I'm sprinkling some tea leaves onto the carpet. That's what they use here to test if a vacuum cleaner is working properly. Look how small they are. Because the tea leaves are so tiny, I've also got some little pieces of coloured paper, so we should be able to see these spinning around the container when they've been sucked up by the vacuum. There we go. Let's switch it on. Look at that! The bits of paper and the tea leaves are being sucked up into the container. and it's coming out here through the exhaust. But we can see it better if I hold this little piece of ribbon up to the exhaust. It's just like a flag on a windy day. So we have a lovely clean carpet, but where do you think all those tea leaves and pieces of paper have gone? That's right, they're inside the container. Let's take a look at my special camera. There they are. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Got a bit dusty, didn't it? <laughs>